हेलो एवरीवन सो दिस इज ए वीडियो नंबर टू वी कैन से और डे टू इफ यू रिमेंबर वी आर डूइंग वन स्मॉल सीरीज फॉर पैकेट ट्रेसर हाउ टू यूज द पैकेट ट्रेसर एंड हाउ वी कैन डू द लैब मोस्टली वी आर डूइंग द सी सी एन ए लैब सो आई होप यू रिमेंबर इन आवर प्रीवियस क्लास वी डिस्कस सम बेसिक स्टफ एंड वी यूज सम डिवाइज एंड वी शोन हाउ टू यूज द डिवाइस नाउ इन दिस क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू टेक टू पी सी and how to connect the cable and how to check the connectivity so if you see this is a packet tracer already we discuss in our previous class just go here if you see here you can see the network device if you go move your cursor here you can see end device click here and you can see here we have the end devices you can just drag and drop like this to computer and we can say this is a to pc and you can move here and now if you want to connect click the cable you have lot of cable here which cable you want you can use if you remember we have the concept before we are using like similar device dissimilar device which cable we need to use cross cable or straight cable so now if you want for lab purpose you want to connect and use just go for this one this is automatic cable click here and click this device click this device and you can see automatically it is adjust the cable itself which cable you get you get this cable so if you remember we told whenever we are connecting two device both are same device like both are computer or both are router we should use the cross cable so both are same device so automatically cable adjust as a cross cable if you are having different device maybe we can say here you have one router here you have one pc then we can use the straight cable okay but nowadays in the router and switch you have the sensor also so automatically port is going to adjust no worries but anyhow this is the old concept you need to remember whenever you are connecting the two machine okay whenever you are connecting if you are using the same machine then you should use the cross cable if you are using the different machine you need to use the straight cable so i taken so this way we can connect the computer if you want to connect the two computer how you can connect just drag and drop and select the cable and connect here now if you want to change the name of this machine if you see here you have pc0 written here pc1 is written here if you want to change the name of this machine click here you can see pc0 you can write here whatever you want to write generally what i am doing i am putting here some ip so i will write 192.168.1.1 .1. so this is a ip actually but i am putting here why i am putting so by seeing this uh, pc i know i am going to assign this ip or if i assign the ip i i should remember by seeing this one okay i put this ip to this this machine that's why i am putting here as a name of this pc as a same ip so it will be simple to remember and to see when you are doing the lab it is easy for you what ip we assign no need to go inside and check here what ip i assign just directly by seeing this label you should know what ip you assign and let's see how we can assign the ip click this computer go to this ip configuration put here and paste here and click here automatically subnet mask will come here so this way we will assign the ip and here also i will assign the ip if you see 192.168.1.2 okay and i will copy this one and then i will go to this computer i will go to the desktop i will go to this one and i will click here and paste so this way i will assign the ip to the other computer okay if you want to zoom in click this one you can zoom in if you want to reset you can click reset so you will have the original if you want to zoom in this one if you want to zoom out this one if you want to remove this port label whatever is looking here go in the option preference and always show the port label in the logical workstation you can uncheck so port will go here if you see now you cannot see the port but it is good if you have the port so if you need click this one you will have the port here okay so this way you can bring the port also so what we can say now we learn how to take the two computer and how to assign the ip address let me save this somewhere so we can use the same topology next time also so i will write here save and let me save this maybe in the desktop okay in the desktop i will create one folder i will say this is a ccnp or let me give packet tracer because this all labs i am going to share in the telegram channel we have our telegram channel you will find the link in our video description try to join that one we are going to share all the labs and the configuration whatever we are doing in that channel 
so i will save here uh, packet tracer labs okay how to use packet tracer or something you can give packet tracer lab okay in uh, packet tracer lab 2024 i can write this is a folder name in this one i will give this one as a dot one and like whatever basic lab or whatever we want we can give here so next time we can use this lab and we can send this file to you also okay so i save here try to join our telegram channel you will get the link in the description and if you need all this topology and configuration whatever we are going to do in this playlist you will get from there so try to join don't forget that one now you need to check this connectivity this both computer to uh, this we can say this both computer are talking to each other or not we need to check that one so we are going to learn how we can make sure these both computers are working or not and in simple we can say these both are talking to each other or not we need to verify that one so how we are going to verify what we are going to do we are going to check in our next class okay so in case if you have any doubts try to write in the video comments you can uh, join our telegram channel instagram also we have you can join there and in the whatsapp number you can uh, ping us give you a problem whatever you have we are going to schedule the time and we are going to support you okay in case if you struck somewhere if you need any support just send the whatsapp message don't call directly because we are busy we don't have time so many guys are calling on the whatsapp so it is difficult for us to manage everything so because i am working as a full-time cloud network engineer and also i am doing this as a part-time as my uh, what we can say my passion and i have the life batches also i need to change teach that life batches one to one so many thing that is paid one so i need to take the time so better you drop the message whenever we are free we are going to check and we are going to reply to you okay so let me stop this one now we can stop in our next video we are going to learn how we can check this both computers are working or not okay thank you